Following the arrest of Mobad childhood friend Ibrahim Oluwatosin Owoduni, popularly known as Prime Boy, who is presently in police custody over the death of Mobad. Ibrahim Tosin Owoduni, Prime Boy, has come out and narrated what happened that led to the death of Mubad. According to the report, the Prime Boy explained that on the night that Mobad performed at Ikorudu alongside such art as Sheunkuti and others, immediately after the performance, he had a disagreement and fracas with Mobad, which led to a fight. Ibrahim Oluwatosi Owodoni Prime Board went further by saying that the two of them exchanged blow and in the process Mobad sustained serious injury. There have been a speculation that during the fight, Prime Boy hit Mobad with a magical ring. But Prime Boy denied this allegation. He said that he did not put on any ring while fighting with Mobad. That it was only his blow that gave Mobad an injury. The injury led to Mobad bleeding seriously. And all efforts to take Mobad to the hospital that they needed a positive as Mobad refused to go to hospital. He also said that Mobad did not die on the same day, on the same night they had the disagreement and fight, that Mobad only passed on the following day. He did not further disclose that Mobad was taken home that particular night, and what led to his death did not he is not in the knowledge of what led to his death as he never followed them to his house that night. Meanwhile, Lagos State Commissioner of Police has come out with the full length of investigation so far carried out on the death of Mobad. The Commissioner of Police disclosed that Naira Mali, Samlari, and the auxiliary nurse that gave Mobad injection are all liable in the death of Mobad. The Commissioner of Police explains that from investigation so far con conducted, the sequence of events that directly occasioned the death of Mobad and the suspect directly involved have established as follows. On the 10th September 2023, Ileri Oluwa Oladimeji Aloba popularly known as Mobad, attended a musical concert at Ikorodu Town Hall at about 9 p.m. on the invitation of Soso Subericom to promote the general bitter beverages. Mobad arrived the venue of the event at about 7 p.m. in the company of his wife, Mrs. Cynthia Omawumi Adebanjo, and their five-month-old baby. His personal assistant, Adi Yeman Boluwatife, popularly known as Darusa, all of whom who were in the Prado Jeep, which was hired by Mobad for the event and, the, and driven by Fidelis Ensemble. Others that accompany Mobad in the separate vehicle include Ayoba Misadik, also known as Spending, Aduragbimi Cedric Aloba, that is Mobad's younger brother. Ajisegiri Sultan Ayobami, Moba DJ, Aderinto Fawaz Ademola, also known as Ade West, Moba's friend and Olarewaju Idris Ade Doja, OG, his photographer. Other musical arts that perform along with Moba at the show include Slatan Ibile, Sheukuti, and DJ Fokati. At the end of his performance, about 11 p.m., as he made to exit the venue with his entourage, he discovered that his vehicle had been blocked by other vehicles, while some of his fans and area boys also mobbed him. Mobad, who was from with, who, who, Mobad, who from witnesses' evidence, was said to have been tipsy 
and hyperactive, became infuriated, and he attempted to come down to clear the road. Ibrahim, his friend, known as Prime Boy, prevailed on him not to go for security reasons. This infuriated Mobad and degenerated into an odd agreement and physical fight between him and Ibrahim. In the course of an attempt to hit Ibrahim with a blow, Mobad missed and smashed the rear window of the Prado Jeep, causing him an injury on his forehand, and he bled profusely. Eventually, the situation was brought under control, and they all departed for the lucky resident of Mobad, excluding Ibrahim. Upon arrival at home at about 2 p.m., 2 a.m. of 11 September 2023, Mobad refused to go to the hospital to treat his injured. Despite persuasion by his wife, staff, and friend, including the Prado Jeep driver, who Faiku was damaged. Later in the day, the injured hand, which was still bleeding, started getting swollen, causing Mobad unbearable pain. His friend Ayoba Misadik, also known as Spending, who noticed the increasing pain, further insisted that he must go to the hospital for treatment. Mobad still resisted and opted to call his personal nurse, identified as Nurse Fumi, who unfortunately was unavailable. At this point, Ayoba Misadik, known as Pendi, offered to call his own nurse, Mrs. Fijisayo Ogedengbe, who attended to Mobad. A suggestion that he, Mobad, consented to. When Mrs. Fijisayo, the nurse, was contacted at about 2.30 a.m. on Monday, 11 September 2023, she was also unavailable but promised to come the following day, being Tuesday, 12 September 2023. Ahead of her arrival, she requested that the picture of the Sony hand be snapped and forwarded to her for assessment and to guide on the medication to come along with. This was eventually done. At about 2.35 on 12 September 2023, Mrs. Fiyisayo eventually arrived, armed with one pack of cetrazone injection, one fair parastamol injection, tetanotazole injection, one fair procaine penicillin, seven ampoules of IM diclofenac tincture, and needle and syringe. Mrs. Fiyisayo, the nurse, administered the tetanotazole on the arm of Mobad and gave both the parastamol and cetrazone injection intravenously. Immediately, the cetrazone injection was administered. Mrs. Fiyisayo confirmed that Mobad started vomiting while ghost pimples appeared on face and all over his body. At this point, it dawned on Mrs. Fiyisayo that Mobad was reacting to the administered medication. She consequently ran out to procure hydro and misophone infection. While at the pharmacy in the locality, she got a call that Mobad had started convulsing. Eventually, Cynthia Omaduni Adibanjo, who is Mobad's wife, and Aduragbimi Sedrak Aloba, Mobad's brother, Olariwaju Idris Ade Doja, Mobad's friend, Aide Abib Ido Udamola, Adeni Tofawas, Ademola and Mrs. Feyisayo rushed in to the hospital in the vehicle of engineer Chinaka Jesse, their neighbor. Unfortunately, Mobad was pronounced dead on arrival at Kura Med Hospital. Not convinced, the team moved his body to Paris Hospital Lekki, where his body was recertified. A death certificate was later issued by Kura Med Hospital. Mobad's father, who had earlier been contacted, came to late Mobad's house and after a short meeting, resolved to move the body to Ikorodu for burial, which was done the following day on the 13th September 2023 at about 2 p.m. This is a statement from the Nigerian police on the investigation so far on late Nigeria popular singer Ileri Oluwa Aloba, popularly known as Mobad.
we will let you know as the event unfold on further investigation from Nigerian police. Stay tuned to this channel and don't forget to subscribe.